Uh, welcome back. Ladies and gentlemen. We are in Davik's compound. And we all know what that means. That means, um... We question why everyone's at ridiculously low HP. Uh... We also need to gear up our boy here. I actually need to check. What's his bonus? Uh, his text bonus is ridiculously fucking low, so it's completely fucking irrelevant. And I believe that is probably the best weapon that he can actually have. Uh, what have I got? Okay, similar, similar. She's rocking a. I'm gonna swap. I'm gonna give her some reflex. He's gonna get Brezhik's belt. The armor. Give him an energy shield. And okay, we're all fine and dandy there. What can I do? Um, let's save our medi packs. Do that. What? She can regain the force powers easily. So we're obviously trying to break out. Yes. Uh, huh? Is Candace by any chance? Sure. Okay, looks like we're going to be attacking our way into sure. every room. Which isn't too bad. I know what room this is. Yeah, buddy. This is the uh, the sexy dam room. We'll start to the guy first because I'm playing a male character. So if you, if I was playing a female, he'd interact differently with me. But because I'm playing a male, he will. Welcome to the slave quarters, good sir. I mean no disrespect, but perhaps one of the female slaves could serve your needs better. Oh, what a fucking sexist. Welcome to the slave quarters, master. Here we have succulent fruits and berries to tempt your palate, as well as luxurious baths to soothe your aches and pains. <laughs> now this is my kind of place. Would you like a relaxing massage? Whatever your desire, we are here to serve. Um... I need some information. But what could I possibly tell you? It is forbidden for slaves to leave this room on pain of torture and death. Let's try persuade her. Uh, tell me why I want to know and I'll let Darbic... Uh, I'll tell Darbic how pleased I was with your performance. Praise from the guest is a valuable commodity here. Davik rewards the slaves who perform their duties well. I will tell you what I know. Davik rarely lets us leave the slave quarters. We only know what we hear from Davik's guests. Recently, they've all been talking about poor Hudro. He was caught trying to steal some spice from the lab. Normally, Hudro is allowed to get away with things like that because he's Davik's personal pilot for the Even Hawk. But since the Sith have grounded every ship on the planet, Hudro doesn't get any more special treatment. They've locked him up in Davik's torture chambers. Uh, where's the torture chamber? I think you can get there through the hall behind the west door of Davik's throne room. Just keep going west from the slave quarters and you'll see the throne room. But Davik's certain to have guards patrolling the area. If you leave the guest wing, they'll shoot you on sight. Please, I don't know anything else. I'd love a massage right now. <laughs> As you wish, Master. You will find this most relaxing. If you would come with me into the massage room at the back. Oh, typically male. Is it possible for you to keep in mind that we have more pressing business to attend to? I trust you are satisfied with the service. I have received many compliments on my skills from previous clients. It was everything I ever dreamed of. You're truly an expert in your craft. Thank you, kind sir. I hope you will express your appreciation to Davik. He often rewards those slaves who perform their duties well. Is there anything else you require? I'll be going now. Of course. Return whenever you wish to partake of what is offered here. We exist only to serve you. Doesn't even heal you. Right, what's this? Welcome to the slave quarters, master. <laughs> Would you like a relax? Uh. As you wish, master. Why not? You will find this most relaxing. If you would come with me into the massage room at the back. Just very repetitive. Um, why is there like two female ones and one male? <laughs> it's just the exact same shit. 
Thank you, kind sir. Uh. Of course. The exact same things. Yeah, two female and one male. Very sexist. Very sexist. Let's uh, bust. And by bust, I mean break in. Yes. And by break in, I mean we just use Basler because she can just like one shot it. Why are you? Why are you here? Get out of me, call guards. Uh, I want to ask some, you some questions. No, no questions. You get out or me get mad. Okay, settle down. I'm going. No bother me more, no more. Huh? Sure. I'm being, I'll be respectful. I actually won't bother him anymore. What can I do? Uh, we'll just play Bastler because lightsabers like get you in so much quicker. A big rancor head. <laughs> I might have to pop some skills in like fucking security or whatever it is. Just to speed this up when a door of a character can fucking do it. Come on, Bastler. There we go, girl. Is that card plus or minus one? And a hair trigger. Sick. <laughs> Make me super OP. Bear Bazaar cards and a data pad. Hang on a minute. What's on the data pad? Uh, how is this fucking ordered? Oh, a record of Kaelor Nord's trophy kills, sentient and otherwise. Last entry is an account of a recent Rancor hunt. When the Rancor locked it, it made up for its size, strength. Forced to resort to more unorthodox to bring the beast down some well, uh, well placed mines near a watering hole with the first step. Their explosions herding the creature into the dead end. Okay. What? Just the story and how. Yes? Yeah. Yes. We've done a Rancor. So I assume this is his room. I think it's safe to say. I think that's the room I started in. Hey, what's the idea of barging in here? Get out of here, or I'll call the guards. Kudu, Tuni Rama na praka donko tsurka chupa tanki. Hey, baby, wait. I wasn't actually going. Damn it. Okay, great. You just scared off my date for the night, so you better explain yourself before I lose my temper and call the guards. I don't need to call the guards, I just got lost. Uh uh. No way, you're not getting out of this mess that easy. You can explain yourself to the guards if you live long enough for them to question you. Oh my god, this guy like fucking. He got fucking prepped. Think anyone's gonna actually run in? Oh, it is, but the doors are opening. Just a slight misunderstanding. Sending the guy is one guy, an aqualish is it? I believe, testicle mouths. Like what he did for call. He was useless. Right, I'm 100% sure this is the room we started in, but for some reason, I'm just inclined to check this chest again. A footlocker. Okay, I assume I, I assume I didn't loot it the first time. I probably just ran out and didn't bother to turn around. Um. Yeah, okay. Okay, loot that one. That is essentially this area over. That's that's the obviously where the, the hangar is. All the doors are fucking open. Oh, I thought I could tempt him round maybe. But obviously everyone else is gonna fucking just run in. Thinking that they're heroes. These jobs are so shit. 
Oh, that was, that was very close. Yes. Uh, surely Candorus can recover the mine. How's that happened? Med pack, spikes, parts. What? How's that happened? How the fuck did they recover it and it fucking blew up on me? Like, how shit are you? Right, let's get a... Uh... Hmm... No, I'm gonna do it. I was thinking maybe if I go around and find more spikes and parts, I could do more shit. But if I've got eight, eight's quite a lot, and I probably won't be doing much anyway. Let's check the security cams. Check the spice lab, full of four audience and an aqualish. I can gas the room for two spikes. Fuck it, why not? Switch the camera, okay. There's a nice room, easily cleared. Braun. The f what the fuck? Don't in this fucking room, Jesus. Thrown room, what fucking. Weird. I can gas any room. I'm just gonna wait a second, see if there's any other options. Right, just so I knew where it was. Spice lab. Can't gas that room. Brawn room. Guest room. Uh, hangar. Uh, what are my assistant commands? Open all security doors. Pretty much already open. Disable hangar security. Disable hangar security. Seven. Upload area schematic. Don't overload terminal because that will end up killing me. Um, I'm just going to gas this final room. Some Durosna Rodian down. Turn the menu, log out. Look at all that XP just flash up on my screen. I just cleared this place out. No man left standing. Computer past ca past card, fucking hell. Good English. Pass card. Oh, this is the pilot guy. Wow, these fucking guys are actually quite strong. I should keep the iron HP down here, it's all good. In the hood. Oh, that's just like flame for a thing on me. That does a lot of damage. However, they grant me a lot of XP. Was that five, 500 just for the kill them two? Oh, a cage release. Thank you. You have no idea what it was like in that torture cage. I don't know how much more I could take before going mad. Uh, I couldn't sit by and just let you suffer. I don't have anything to give you as a reward for freeing me. Nothing tangible, anyway. But I've got information that could be worth a fortune. I used to be the pilot of the Ebonhawk, Davik's flagship. I know the codes to disable the security system protecting it. I'll load them onto your data pad now. You can use those codes to steal the Ebonhawk right out of its hangar. Sell it to the highest bidder, ransom it back to Davik. Whatever you do, you'll make thousands. Uh, okay, you're free to go now. Oh, no, I want to ask you some questions. Questions? Please. I've already told you the only useful thing I know. Just let me go before Davik figures out I'm missing. Okay, you're free to go now. Oh no! Almost clicked two. Long until Davik figures out I'm free, I have to get out of this base before that happens. How funny would it be if just then he runs out and gets shot? We should get going. I'm sorry, but Candace, you don't understand how this game works. What happens is, I know we're in a rush, but like quotes rush. But we've got like shit to do. We've got like fucking yes. what can I do? rooms to break into. Got rooms to break into and 
shit to loot. Oh, some strong boxes. We've definitely got things to loot. There's so much shit in here. Okay, next room. Hey! Wait a bloody minute. There's nothing in here. Oh. Shit, hang on a minute. Boss push. Roll lightsaber. Roll, roll lightsaber. Flurry that guy. Proof blaster shot that guy and then I'm control. Oh my god, he got fucking destroyed. This is it, the one on ones. Come on. Oh my he like did a flip! He got force pushing like flipped. Oh kick to the head for a finisher. That's what I'm talking about. Fucking come at me, son. Oh no. Oh no, I'm good. Did I loot this guy? Droid? Oh my god, look at the fucking mist and fog in these corridors. Couldn't even see that far. Um Is that everything? Is that everywhere, sorry? What can I do? Pop that. Yes. So I've been that's where I started. I've looted that area. I went there. I came here and I've come right round. All that's left is the hangar then. And uh, this belt in the corner. I did gas a few rooms, like didn't I? So. You need to find a computer panel to see. Oh, okay. Use the access card. Oh fuck! I could have used that. I could have saved so many spikes. Just cast the room. Oh, no, I can still use you still have to use. It. I said I would have saved one spike because you still need to use spikes. I thought it would have been like a mass override. Like the hangar. No surprises coming from there. Uh, disable hangar security. I'm sure we'll have no surprises when we enter this room. Damn no Sith, they're bombing the whole thing. No. Why, why would he stood? Oh, look what we got here. Thieves in a hangar. So, you figured you'd just steal my ship for your getaway and leave me high and dry while the Sith turn the planet into dust? Sorry, but that ain't gonna happen. I'll take care of them, Davik. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. Make it quick, Carlo. The Sith mean business. If we don't get to our ships and find somewhere safe, the bombs dead drop and will kill us all. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Right. Right, we're paused. What are we doing? What is the plan? What is the strat? Boss Valor for the buff. Energy shield. Uh, see if energy shield will do then. Another energy shield. Yes. We'll go from there. Then we'll go from... Look, I'm just stood there waiting. Oh shit, I actually don't do that. Did 
Do I just have a frag? There we go, I'll just throw a frag at him. I think he's, sh he's gonna shield. Thermal detonator will blow us all to bits. Damn no shit! I'll bring this whole hangar down around our ears. <laughs> yes. So stupid. Yes. What? Sure. You can't even fucking loot me, but. Do you know why you can't loot him? Because he's not dead. I bet he's not even dead. I can't remember if in Legends he did die. He probably didn't. He probably survived. Somehow. Um, what were they doing though? You went there and the fucking just stood around like, from that corner. What were they doing? I'm a little fucking chimwag over there. You wish to board the Ebon Hawk. Board the Ebon Hawk. Let's get this ship fired up. We'll pick up the rest of your friends and then we'll have to get off this planet. Taris is defenseless against our assault, Lord Malak. They are offering no resistance. The city is in ruins. Resume the bombardment, Commander. Wipe this pathetic planet from the face of the galaxy. Plot a course for Dantooine. There's a Jedi Enclave there where we can find refuge. Incoming fighters! Quickly, to the gun turrets. You have to hold the Sith fighters off until we get those hyperspace coordinates punched in. Shit, I forgot about this cool little minigame. Destroy every fighter, I believe. Oh my god, I'm doing so bad. Oh my god, I'm doing so so bad. Oh my god, I'm doing so bad. I'm panicking. There's a one. Okay, one more, one more.
Dantooine. Seems like a lifetime since I last set foot on her surface. Though in truth, it's only been a few months. We should be safe from Malak here. For now, at least. Safe? You saw what his fleet did to Terrace. There wasn't a building over two stories high left standing. They, they turned the planet into one big pile of rubble. Even the Sith would think twice before attacking Dantooine. There are many Jedi here, including several of the most powerful masters of the Order. There is great strength within this place. Uh... Who do you go with? Because I kind of like Kaf. Kaf's like kind of a reasonable guy, and it seems a bit random. I'm gonna go with Kaf because I like Kaf. We can't just keep running. Malak will find us eventually. We need to regroup. We need a plan. We can get supplies here and recuperate. The academy is a place of mental and spiritual healing. Something we could all use after what we've been through. Maybe you're right. It isn't easy to witness the annihilation of an entire planet. I know Mission must be taking it pretty hard. She will find a way to come to terms with her grief. She's stronger than she appears. We just need to give her time. Now I must go speak with the Council. I need their advice on recent developments. After I've met with them, I'll meet you outside the ship. I've spoken briefly with the Council. They request an audience with you. We should go at once. An audience with the Jedi Council? It's pretty unusual for someone who isn't even a Jedi. What's this about, Bastila? I'm sorry, Karth, but I cannot tell you. All I ask is that you trust in the Force and the wisdom of the Council. Well, I don't like being left out of the loop, but I'm not looking to get you in any trouble with the Jedi Masters. We'll do things your way for a while. Come, they're expecting us. I will lead you to the Council Chambers. Until you've talked with the Jack Council, you'll be unable to switch characters in and out of pie. Okay, we made it. With the big leagues! With the Jedi Enclave on Dantooine. Evan Hawk, you've now game session. The Evan Hawk. Anyone there's workshop tools you could use. Upgrade, okay. If you found a track somewhere, you might be able to make some good money with it. Oh cool, there's a swoop icon bar. How fucking sick is that? Right, I'm gonna leave it there for now. It's a good spot, I think, to leave it at. Don't forget to like, favorite, share, subscribe. Until next time.